JJ, wake up! You won't believe it! There's been a zombie apocalypse! We need to check the news right now to find out what's really going on in the world while you were sleeping. Zombie apocalypse? Seriously, Mikey? Are you sure it's not just some crazy dream? JJ, I found a baseball bat and some canned food in the kitchen. What did you get? Just a couple of flashlights, some bottled water, and a first aid kit. I couldn't find any weapons. That'll do for now. We should barricade the doors and windows. I saw a hardware store a few blocks away. We can check there for better weapons and supplies. Good idea. Uh, let's see what they'll show on TV. We've barricaded everything. We just have to watch the news to find out the truth about what happened in this city. While we were sleeping, I hope that there won't be anything bad there. We need to stay quiet and keep an eye out for any signs of trouble. Mikey, have a look at this. The news is reporting a zombie apocalypse. The city was attacked by zombies. The only way to escape is to go to the port to board a ship that will open soon. If you want to survive, you must get there. I hope that you will be safe since there is no other chance to survive. They say our only chance of survival is to get to that rescue ship at the port. Are you serious, JJ? A zombie apocalypse? That sounds insane. Mikey, I've got an idea. We could grab the tools from the toolbox in the back and start digging tunnels to get to that port as quickly as possible. It might be our best chance to reach there safely. Great! Let's grab the shovels, pickaxes, and some gloves and start digging. We'll need to make sure we stay safe while underground. Mikey, we made it to the port. Let's go talk to the police officer and ask for passage onto the rescue ship. Right, JJ. Let's hope they'll let us on. Excuse me, officer. We've heard about the rescue ship. Can you help us get on board? I wish I could, but you'll need to speak with the ship's captain. He's the one who decides who can come aboard. The ship is just over there. Thank you, officer. We'll go talk to the captain and hope for the best. Let's not waste any time, JJ. We're so close to safety. Let's head to that ship over there and see if we can talk to the captain. Maybe they'll allow us to come aboard. Mikey, there's the captain on the bridge. Let's ask him if he can allow us on the ship. Captain, excuse us for the interruption, but we've heard about the rescue ship, and we're hoping you can let us on board for our safety. Well, folks, it's a dire situation out there. We can't take everyone, but we do have some room left. Absolutely, Captain. We'll do whatever it takes to be an asset and follow your orders. You can count on us! We just want to survive this nightmare! Captain, we're grateful for allowing us on board. Can we stay here with you and your crew? Well, it's a delicate situation, but I do have a mission in mind. If you can help us with it, I'll let you stay. You see, we need to repair some critical wires in the engine room. We're not exactly experts, but we'll give it a shot. If we help with this repair, can we stay on the ship with you? So, JJ, what do you think about this whole spaceship adventure? It's amazing, Mikey. The engine room is just mind-blowing. Can't believe we're actually going down there. Look, JJ, there's a chest over here. It seems to have some wires in it. Interesting. Let's grab those wires. They might come in handy later. That's interesting. Maybe we can use these wires to fix something in the engine room. JJ, I need your help. Mikey, who's with you, has to come with me to the top deck. You'll have to fix the wires yourself. All right, Captain. Mikey, go with him. I'll handle the wires down here. Mikey, the captain's coming down, and he says he needs your help. I have to fix the wires myself while you and my captain head back up. Something doesn't feel right. Why am I suddenly so scared? And the dim, flickering lights cast eerie shadows on the walls. It's fixed, but... I can't help but think about what might be lurking in the darkness. Oh no, zombies! I have to fight them off. Sounds of struggle. I've taken care of them, but we're still in danger. Part of the ship is damaged, and I need to inform the captain. Fixing these wires won't solve these problems. I have to find the captain. I see a horde of zombies, and I'm holding them off, but I'm still in danger. Part of the ship is damaged, and I need to inform Captain Wires. Can't handle these problems alone, so I'm going to find the captain. Be careful out there. I'll keep these zombies at bay as long as I can. Captain Wire, we've got a situation. The ship has a massive hole in the front, and it's preventing us from moving forward. This is a major setback, but we can't lose hope. We have a contingency plan. What's the plan, Captain? We need to repair the ship, but it won't be easy. Our biggest challenge is convincing the crew that it's even possible. They don't believe in us, Captain. We need to find a way to get them on board. Let's gather the crew and discuss our options. It won't be an easy task, but we've faced worse before. We have to make them see that with determination and teamwork. I agree, Captain. We'll need to show them that together, we're stronger. And we'll need to set an example by working hard and making progress ourselves. We're all in this together. We'll repair the ship and continue our journey. It won't be easy, 
but I have faith in each one of you. Let's get to work, team. We can do this. JJ, did you see that? The whole ship just exploded, but those monsters didn't even touch us. Yeah, it's insane. I've never seen anything like this. They destroyed our ship, but we're unharmed. What's going on? Look, there's that bird-like creature. It seems to be leading the monsters. Let's follow it and see what it's trying to show us. Agreed, Mikey. This is bizarre, but we can't ignore it. Let's go and find out what's going on. It's really strange how that bird seems to be in control of those creatures. I can't help but feel curious about what they're up to. Me too, Mikey. It's like they deliberately wanted to get our attention. I wonder what they want to show us. Well, I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's keep a safe distance, but follow them and see where they lead us. Right. We need to stay cautious. But this might be an opportunity to uncover something extraordinary. Let's stick together and see where this unexpected journey takes us. JJ, look at this! We followed the bird-like creature and the monsters to this strange hangar. There's just water and gates here. This is getting even more bizarre. What could all of this mean? This is a portal, a gateway to another world. I've heard stories about it, but I never thought I'd actually see one. A portal to another world? Look at that. It's forming into blocks and structures, and there's a portal appearing in front of us. That's incredible. But why did they bring us here? Captain, can you shed some light on this? I can't believe my eyes. This is like something out of a sci-fi movie. Well, we've come this far. It's not every day you get a chance to step into the unknown. Everyone, this is our assistant. It seems it can't speak, but it's trying to communicate something. This is not what I expected. Are you sure, Captain, that we can trust this thing? It doesn't look friendly, Captain. What's going on here? I thought it was here to help us, but it appears it has betrayed us. All right, let's do this. We faced dangers before, and we can handle this. We're not backing down now. Captain, lead the way and let's get to the bottom of this. I can't believe we trusted that creature. But Captain's right. We need to confront it. Let's give it a shot, JJ. Yeah, it's hard to swallow. But maybe there's a way to make sense of all this. Let's go through the portal with the Captain's guidance. Or maybe a nightmare. I can't even describe it. Hey, JJ, did you see that bird when we came out of the portal? It seemed like it wanted to tell us something. Yeah, I noticed that too, Mikey. It was acting strange. Anyway, check this out. We're in a house and there are superhero costumes here. Superhero costumes? That's awesome. I've always wanted to be a superhero. Let's try them on. Maybe we should try to figure out what that bird was trying to tell us. It could be important. These superhero costumes are incredible. I can't believe we can actually fly with them. That's going to be a game changer when it comes to dealing with those nasty zombies that invaded our world. You're right, Mikey. We have the power to fly. And that should give us the advantage we need to take on those zombies. Let's put these costumes to good use. Absolutely, JJ. Let's head back into the portal and confront those zombies. With our newfound abilities, we'll be able to protect our world and put an end to this invasion. Mikey, JJ, we're counting on you. It's time to start taking out those zombies. Here, take this weapon. It's your best bet against them. Thanks, Captain. We won't let you down. Let's do this. Look, there's a group of zombies up ahead. Let's take them down and make our world safe again. Agreed, Mikey. Ready? Fire. These weapons are incredible, JJ. With this kind of firepower, we'll make short work of these zombies that invaded our world. Absolutely, Mikey. And it looks like the doctor gave us something really powerful. Let's show those zombies what we're made of. These weapons are incredible, JJ. With this firepower, we can take down those zombies that invaded our world. Absolutely, Mikey. The doctor was right. JJ, look! That colossal zombie boss is on the horizon. We need to take it down, but it's eating up tons of ammo. We've got to do this together. I see it, Mikey. We've got to keep our cool. Let's focus on hitting its weak points. Pass me some of those grenades. Here you go, JJ. Take these grenades. I'll cover you while you aim for its head. It's our best shot. Thanks, Mikey. I'll try to get some headshots. Keep an eye out for any smaller zombies trying to sneak up on us. You got it, JJ. I'll handle the crowd control. Just make those shots count. That's the last of them, JJ. You go on ahead to help the people. I'll cover you here. Thanks, Mikey. I'll hurry and lend a hand where I can. Time is running out, and people need our help. Be careful out there, JJ. We'll regroup later. Good luck. JJ, check it out. There's a girl up on the lighthouse. She must have taken refuge there from the zombies. We can't leave her stranded. Absolutely, Mikey. We can't just walk past her. Let's go up there and see if she's okay. Hey, are you all right up there? 
I'm stuck. Please, help me get down. The zombies are everywhere. Don't worry, we're here to help. Mikey, can you give her a hand? You're safe now. We're going to get you to a secure place. Thank you both so much for rescuing me. I don't know how to express my gratitude. It's all part of the job. We're just glad you're okay. Take care and be safe. We have to keep moving. There's a lot more to do out here. We are flying further. We still have a lot to do. We must now help our friends who are in the city since the zombie apocalypse is not over. JJ, look over there. It seems like some kind of attack on the city. Do you see what's causing it? Mikey, I think it's the Ender Dragon. It's destroying everything in its path and we need to stop it. Let's do this. You're right, JJ. We can't let it destroy the city. Our weapons are doing a good job so far, but it's getting tougher. We'll have to be careful. Mikey, watch out for its fiery breath. We need to dodge it. Keep firing those arrows. I see its weak points, JJ. Aim for the crystals on top of those obsidian pillars. That should weaken it. Nice shot, JJ. It's getting weaker. Keep going. JJ, we did it. The Ender Dragon is defeated. But look at our home and everything we owned. It's all in ruins. I know, Mikey. It's heartbreaking. But we can rebuild. We're alive, and that's what matters most. JJ, look over there. It's a tank. And it seems like it's been here for a very long time. Our house is completely destroyed. But this tank is a mystery. This is so strange, Mikey. How did a tank end up here? It's like a relic from the past. JJ, look! It's the bird that gave us those superpowers. It's here, and it seems like it's taking them away from us without saying a word. What's happening, Mikey? I thought we were doing good with these powers. Why is it taking them back? JJ, it looks like we've lost our superpowers and turned back into regular people. We need to run! The zombies are closing in on us. Mikey, let's get out of here. They're getting closer, and we can't fight them off without our powers. This is bad, JJ. We're trapped in this corner, and there's no way out. What do we do now? 